Now to the big space mission due to launch tomorrow. Boeing hoping its first crewed mission of its new and long-delayed Starliner capsule will help revive its battered reputation. ABC's Faith Bube joins us live from Atlanta's Fern Bank Science Center. And Faith, good morning. What is that behind you? <laughs> Good morning to you, Jenny. Behind me is the original Apollo 6 command module, which launched back in 1968. Now, fast forward 56 years later, it's a new frontier. The countdown is on as Boeing tries to launch its first crewed mission to the International Space Station. This long-delayed flight, which was supposed to launch humans in 2020 under NASA's commercial crew program, finally ready to go. Boeing Starliner spacecraft, when first tested, had a computer problem that put it in the wrong orbit. And now, years later, it's finally ready to launch humans into space. NASA has two of its most experienced astronauts on Monday's test flight, pilot Sunita Williams and Commander Butch Wilmore. We're absolutely confident in all aspects. We don't expect to have significant failure modes. We don't expect things to go wrong, but we, we know that we are going to be fine because we have this backup capability. This mission launching on a United Launch Alliance Atlas V from Pad 41 at Cape Canaveral, six decades after the Atlas launched John Glenn on his historic mission. The last human to launch from here, Gordon Cooper on Mercury back in May 1963. Boeing's Leroy Kane says having a crew on board is what they need to test the Starliner. The crew uh, interaction with Starliner to see how well does she work with people inside. Boeing needs a successful launch having fallen behind the other commercial launch provider SpaceX, which just unveiled its new high-tech spacesuit. SpaceX hoping to launch another private Polaris mission, which will send astronauts on the first private spacewalk with these newly designed spacewalking suits later this year. Meantime, the Starliner rocket now on the launch pad. The crew saying goodbye to their family and friends as the countdown to liftoff begins. And I'm thankful that this time has transpired because mm -hmm. we've learned so much. It's been really useful time working with, you know, NASA engineers and the Boeing company to really understand the spacecraft. And the Starliner is scheduled to launch at 10.34 p.m. in Florida tomorrow night. It has rolled onto the launch pad, and as one astronaut put it, it's ready to dance amongst the stars. Will? All right, Faith, it's time. Looking forward to seeing that and how it goes.